The pregame festivities are over, and we're just about set to get this game underway. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Cowboys have been talking with them this week, Kirk. It's just interesting, their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself. And I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him the football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time, where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome and I, I'll be shocked if they can slow him down they come up to the line here at second down and 14 after the sack great pressure on the quarterback forced that incompletion Boy, they really pounded him on that throw that brings up third and 14. Kill, kill, kill! Gunner three! Hit. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. I'd say that went about as well as the defense hoped it would. This is the kind of solid, consistent play you look for in your defense. Let's see if the offense can follow it up. Oh, excellent punt. Whoa, he just took a licking. So the opening drive failed to produce any points. Well, they had their opportunities here to make some plays to try to quiet this crowd, but they weren't able to do it. If things keep going this way, this stadium is going to get even louder. And he's taken down around the 36-yard line. That makes it second so it's second down and about two yards to go. his way to about the 45. Nothing tentative on that run at all. He looked very determined and got the first down. He makes his way to about the 38. So he keeps it and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. It's first and 10. Ball on the 38-yard line. And he's tackled right around the third. He rifles it to the left. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch. This guy has that innate ability to get just enough distance from a defender to make a completion possible. You don't see it from every receiver, but this guy's got it. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. A six-play, 72-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Horned Frogs are right where they want to be early in this one, Parker. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game point. Got a man, they knocked it loose. You can't blame him for not hanging on to that pass. He got hit pretty hard. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25. 
They'll line up with five wide receivers. Red, red. Red. Kill, kill, kill! Black one. There's a strike complete. Any offense is predicated on being able to move efficiently like this. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Kill, kill, kill. Quick throw out to the receiver. Brought down at the 45-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. Easy, easy. Throws out and through his hands. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 45. fortunate to come up with that pass. Not the smartest throw that he could have made, but it worked. It just makes you a little nervous when he lets that thing go. Red two! Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. Here's the eighth play of the series. That makes it second and ten. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. And he's leveled at the 25-yard line. That's good for a game of 18 yards. Let's make these babies cry all the way back home. Let's make these babies cry all the way back home. He's taken down around the 17-yard line. Part of the eight yards. That'll bring up second and three. With a quick throw. Leaps picked off. Good job to pick that ball off. He did a great job at getting in that passing lane and coming away with the ball. We got a first and ten. Ball in their own 20. TCU is up a score. down 10 yards to go ball on the 35 and they make the stop at about the 47 yard line three-yard line, and that run got stuck. Yeah, you're right. The defense definitely won the battle at the line of scrimmage there. Second and 14. Ball on the 43-yard line. facing a big pass rush. The ball had no chance of being caught by one of his teammates. That's what pressure will do for any defense. First and 10, ball on the 44.
caught out in the open. They'll bring him down at the 36. Not a bad little play there. Yeah, this is a nice job by the quarterback reading the coverage and delivering a very catchable ball and allowing his receiver to come up with a nice game. Easy, easy, please, 15. Quick strike to the receiver, and down he goes around the 27-yard line. Number six on the tackle at the 27-yard line. First down. He fights forward to about the 26. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. Both offenses trying to find their rhythm in that first quarter. Low scoring and close right now. The Horned Frogs in front, 7-0. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. Check, 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 check. Mike, 36. Mike, 36. Fires it out. And he is drilled at the 13. They're in the red zone, so this quarterback better be smart. Last time, he threw a pick down here. Big play, and it's first and goal. First and goal. Touchdown, Oklahoma State. A short burst for the score. That's what happens when you can win the war in the trenches down near the goal line. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. And he converts the extra point. A seven-play, 43-yard drive, and they put up seven points. Fred, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. An interception cut this offense last drive short, so I think they're going to be looking for a little more success right here. So much in football is about how you respond to adversity. Moving forward after a turnover is a perfect example of that. From their own 30-yard line, it's second down. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Well, that's just a good call from the defensive side of the football. They know what this team likes that to run, and they right got up. the better of them that time. Gains his way to the 33-yard line. Certainly, they don't have the return on here. Booming kick. Fielded at the 19. He makes it to the 28-yard line. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum, so as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. And he was pretty much stuffed on that run. You know what, that was just a nice job by the defense in stopping him before he could get going and build up momentum. It's second down now, 13 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. Check, check. Answer, dancer. Here they come. Let's it fly. Oh, what an interception. was just an outstanding pick. Great play by the defender to high point the ball, but the quarterback wasn't in rhythm on the throw. First and 10, ball on the 30. Set, Oklahoma. Set. 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 
past tight end, and he wasn't ready for it. The pass ball is incomplete. Number 49, the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and 10. I don't even know why this team showed up. He's at the 20, gains his way to the 16-yard line. From the 16-yard line, first down. Straight up the middle, and he'll lose yardage. That is a loss of one yard on the play. That'll bring up second and 11. He's on the run. No one open, so he's going to run. And he's taken down at the 13-yard line. That makes it third and seven. Third down and seven. Ball on the 13. Screen pass. He's got his half back. Nice play to set up first and goal. to his receiver, touchdown. And they hook up on the short pass play for the touchdown. Nice call down here, this close to the goal line. The defense is thinking run, and they pass instead. He splits the uprights with the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Oklahoma State's coaching staff, I've got a thing going into halftime, and we're getting close right now, Kirk. They've got to do something different. What they had planned with their star running backs just not working today. Well, I think the continuity between a coaching staff and a quarterback and an offense is tested. Uh, their, their star player is not having a great game. They're losing this football game. I think now as we're close to this half, now's when you start to think about it. Interception. He lets it fly. And he's tackled around the 48-yard line. This shows some great preparation by the defensive staff. It seems like he can't throw a pass without a defender knowing where it's headed. From the 48-yard line, it's first down. TCU is up seven. His man can't tack on any yardage. About six yards on that completion. Well, he really didn't have to do too much there to give himself a little room to make the catch. Fires out to his wideout. And he tackles him hard at the 34-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. Here's a draw, and he hits him hard at the 36-yard line. That's a loss of two yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 12. He's out of bounds at the 34. That brings us third, third down, and they need to get it to the 24. Three down, three down. Hey, check mic 45. Check mic 45. Ready. Black 90. Black 90. Motion. Hut hut. Hut hut. to set up a little screen. Gets it to his tailback. Brought down at the 25. Easy, easy, easy. Fox two, Fox two. 
Pushed out of bounds around the 22 yard line. It's first and 10. Ball of the 22. TCU up seven points. Let's go! He's hit and taken down. Around an eight yard pickup on the slant route from the quarterback. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. He's going to try and scramble. Looking for the corner. attack is capable of making some big plays. They've got to get on their toes. They call it a catch, but the booth signaled down to the referee that they'd like to take another peek at this. Man, as I see this play again, it really looks like he made the correct call on the field. After review the play, the ruling on the field stands. So the call on the field stands. And he hits the PAT. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. I'm sure the quarterback would love to make amends for that last pick. If they can play sound football from here out and make a few plays, there's no reason they can't get back into this. Tackle at the 31. Six yards that time on the pass play. You get six yards, and that makes picking up a first down very reasonable. They're about four yards away here on second down. Throws it deep. Oh, so close to breaking it. Excellent execution on one side of the ball that time. And it looks to me like the defense was in a little state of confusion. Let's see if they can pull themselves together. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. And he's hit immediately. The quarterback and his receiver make a great play here and convert on an early down. Now he tries to buy some time. That's a great tackle at the 12-yard line. As they head to the locker rooms, this one is far from over. TCU's lead is two touchdowns. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Chris Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. The halftime lead is not insurmountable for this squad. And, you know, there are a lot of times when you watch the first half of the game and you start talking about mental toughness and, and energy and effort and all of those types of things. You get the sense this is more of an X and O deal for the coaches. A couple of minor adjustments that could really change the game in the second half. Yeah, if it, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But if it's broke, it needs to be fixed. And there's some things that you definitely see offensive and defensively that these teams need to be sharper. They need to be crisper. They need to find an edge. Maybe they need to go more up-tempo. Maybe they need to pass the football a little bit more. Defensively, maybe you need to be a little bit more aggressive. This is, this is one of those things where coaches have to feel out. They have a feeling out process. They have to feel what you do well, what you're not doing well. And sometimes you need to completely go in a different direction. You're down two scores. Something good has to happen. You need to change what you've been doing because it hasn't worked. We've done what we can do here at halftime. Time to get you back out to the second half. We'll keep an eye on everything going on in college football. Fred Nessler and Kirk Herbstreit ready with a call.
All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, this offense has found the end zone on their last two drives, and they're coming out on this one trying to do much of the same. So the sack makes this a second and long. Here comes the pressure. They bring him down. That's a loss of five yards. That'll bring up third and long. What was that? Tight right, tight right. Three down, three down. Hey, check Mike 45. Check Mike 45. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. He tackles him for a loss. Call a loss of one yard on the play. Fourth down. Puts it away, and it's a great kick. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. They come out on an empty backfield. And he's immediately tackled. Gets out to around the 32. There's nothing more effective that a team can do offensively than to pound the ball right at the defense, trying to wear them down. Slings it. He's taken down at the 22-yard line. Black five. He's tackled right around the 14-yard line. That's a game right, 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 right. That makes it second and two. Fires out quickly to the tailback. Tackle made right around the four-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. Gets it off as he's hit. Complete. It's second and goal. Ball on the four-yard line. And down he goes at about the nine-yard line. And this play is number eight on the drive. Defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack. And somehow, he's able to throw the ball away. It's fourth down. They're going to go for the easy three here. He gets it up, and he's got it. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The last time this offense had the ball, it was three and out. And they make 
make the stop right around the 40. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 40. They go to the ground game. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Call it a loss of two yards on the play. That'll bring up second and 12. The defender had it and then dropped it. Well, the big man here isn't used to making catches as a defensive lineman. But I'll tell you, he was still pretty athletic just to get his hands on. Third down now, and they need to get it out to the 50. Again with the carry, and they got him for a loss. Loss of one yard on the play. That'll bring up fourth and 13. Excellent punt. Gets to about the 24-yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. They'll bring him down at about the 25-yard line. About a yard there on the quarterback keeper. There's the junior quarterback making a very solid stop. Anytime your corners can contribute like that against the run, it gives your defense another advantage. Quick toss. Got it to the senior. And he's finally shoved out at the 47. First down. Tackled right away. Call it a gain of six yards. That'll bring up second and three. Nice run, and he's brought down. That's a gain of five on the play. First down. Throws it in a hurry, and he's hit before he can go anywhere. That'll bring up second and 12. From the 38-yard line, it's second down. That's a gain of 14 yards on the play. Watch the screen, watch the screen. That makes it first and 10. Watch 36, 36 to Mike. Go! They'll give it off here. That brings up second and nine. it out to maybe the 20-yard line. And the halfback carries for a pickup of three. Five, three, six. Five, three, six. He scrambled. And he's taken down at the 11-yard line. It's not over yet, folks. We head to the fourth quarter. TC used in front by 11.
back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Watch 36, 36 to Mike. Dog four, blue four, go. blue. Go. He's scrambling. And he's tackled at the six. That makes it second and six. throws it away. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. 13th play of the drive coming up. Kill, kill, kill! Three. Touchdown, Oklahoma State! They're looking to get two points here. Enzo picked off. And they won't get the two. It was a 13 play, 76 yard drive. And they get six points on the board after failing the two point conversion. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Careful. Let me tell you, his throw had to be perfect, and it was. Good coverage by the defense that time, but sometimes that's not good enough. From their own 39-yard line, first down. There's a strike complete. He's down. Tackles him hard at the 44. Loss of two on the play. That'll make it 35. From their own 44-yard line, it's third down. Let's go. Throws it to the halfback on the screen. Brought down at the 48-yard line. Well, that was a perfect time to call a screen pass there by the offense. The defense had pinned their ears down, and they were coming after the quarterback. They were out of position. The quarterback waited just to the right time to drop it down to the running back. Quick throw. quick throw, and they push him out at about the 45. From the 45-yard line, second down. Easy, easy, easy. Big dog, big dog. Hot, hot. Hot, hot. He makes it to the 45 yard line. No that makes it 37. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 38. Just under three to go in regulation. Ready! Black 85! Black 85! He gets rid of this one. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. This is not the type of game you'd expect to see from an experienced quarterback. Well, at this point, taking care of the football has to be their number one priority. If they want to get back in this game, if you can't take care of the ball, you just have no chance. 
Well, when you play on the road, it's tough to be perfect, but he's not making things any easier for his teammates. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. And he hits him hard at the 13-yard line. Defense looking for another sack in the second down and long situation. Mike, 36. Mike, 36. He's going to try and scramble. Tackle at the 25. Kill, kill. Go for it. Over the middle to his tailback. He's taken down at the 37. Easy, easy. Blue 20. First down. Red 2. Blue 4. Blue 4. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 37-yard line. There. Easy, easy. Flair, flair. Just over a minute in the fourth quarter. He's going to go for the home run. And it's a whole new ball game. So they'll go for two here and try to go up by a field goal. Here's the call from the referee. Delay game, offense. You got to be careful to avoid these. Penalties are a great way to stall out a drive. You don't really gain anything by kicking the extra point here, so they'll go for two and try to go up by three. Dumps it out left to the running back. They don't get it. Not much there on the screenplay. They line up to kick this one away. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Time's running short here, so let's see what plays out. 
The offense is trying to get in the field goal range here to maybe win this game. I'm excited to watch the defense. What kind of strategy will we see from this defense? Are they going to sit back and give them the easy throws underneath? Or will they continue to be aggressive, play tight coverage, and try to pressure the quarterback? From their own 25-yard line, second down. A little over a minute in the game. Ready! Out of bounds at about the 29-yard line. Clears it out to the right to the halfback. Just a tremendous job by that defense, and their coordinator did a super job there to keep it this close in this ball game. And now the offense has got a chance to win it. That's a great tackle at the 39. He lets it go. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 50 yard line. Can't get away from the pressure. That'll bring up third and long. Ready! Flag 98! Flag 98! Hut hot! Great one to win, a really tough one to lose. Oklahoma State, 22. TCU, 21. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Kirk Street, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.